I'm just gonna keep the camera aimed behind us because there's a guy with a gun following us. What is up sergeants? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm in the middle of the desert. As you guys can see, it's super bright. I can barely keep my eyes open, but we are going to explore a haunted ghost town here in the middle of the desert. Check it out. I'm here in the desert. It's so cool. I rarely get a chance to ever come out to the desert, but today I'm here with none other than my beautiful wife Shadia. Hello baby. Shadia's first time to the desert. We are road tripping back to Canada from Los Angeles and we are going to be stopping off in different states and cities for a few days. We're actually going to be stopping off and sleeping in Vegas for three days. So if you guys are in Vegas and you have locations, hit us up. We're going to be heading to Utah. We're going to be heading to Colorado. We're going to be heading to a lot of cool states. I'll keep you guys posted on my Instagram and Twitter. So you guys make sure you're following me on Twitter and Instagram to know if I'm going to be in your area really soon. We're doing a full USA road trip. So I'm very excited about this one what do you guys say we go inside explore this ghost town and see what's up definitely go give shadia a follow on instagram her link is down below guys check it out it's so like weird it's so quiet, it's so quiet here we're between like these mountains whoa dude this is so cool and it's so quiet and there's this weird door that goes into the mountain there's a really creepy cemetery nearby as well look at that there's a door there i don't know where that goes but that's freaking scary. Some of you guys might know what this ghost town is all about. I don't, I don't know any history. We literally just stumbled upon this and I think we can just walk right into it. Yo, look at this. This is cool. This is so cool. We're literally between mountain. mountains. Guys, where we come from in Canada, we don't have mountains. It's all flat. So forgive us if we get a bit too excited over <laughs> some mountains. <laughs> look at this, it's like a little mine shaft thing here. And up we go. Where does it stop? I have no idea. You know, it's harder to breathe out here. Yeah, I know. Because <laughs> of the elevation. Shadi and I just made it up to the ghost town. Can you barely, like, breathe? I can't breathe up here, I know. Hard. It's hard to breathe, it's weird. Well, I mean, we did just walk up a whole shitload of stairs. I thought this place was gonna be, like, abandoned, but there's a lot of tourists. It's still cool to see. Smash the like button if you guys enjoy watching content like this. Um, I want to find out some more information about this place. So there you have it you guys. We are currently inside of this ghost town um, It was long abandoned. I think it used to be a mining town. We're still trying to find out more details To what's going on here. Dude look at this piano. Oh Please do not touch. Okay, I won't touch. Don't touch the piano. <laughs> oh my god. It's a Wells Fargo bank safe over here on the ground What's that? Bobcat yeah, there's bobcats in the area that live here. You want to take one home? Oh I'd be so down. There's bobcats, there's lizards, there's ja uh, those big rabbits. Tarantulas, your favorite, scorpions, rattlesnakes. Oh my god. Also, um, yeah, the foxes. All of this here? There's a lot of animals around here, yeah. So cool, you guys. Look at this. This is what the town it's used so to look like back in the day. Yo, check it out. There's tools left over from way back when. So cool. What is the stuff on the outside? Um, some type of like, it looks like mud. Insulation. I think it's mud. Really? Yeah, I think they used to insulate their buildings back in the day with some type of mud. Yeah, because like, look, you can see it's like the same as what they get on the ground. Yo, that is creepy. Yeah. So they're here buried on this site is a time capsule. That's so so crazy. a long time ago, on December 13th, 1981, they buried a time capsule that's not to be opened until, until 2031. 2031. So there's some cool items in there. Wait, what's going on? My camera stopped working the second we got up over here. Are you look, serious? Yeah, look at this. Look. So the camera's rolling. Off. This is how you turn the camera off. It's still rolling. On. That's so strange. Look, I can't I can't record. I can't take pictures. What just happened? I don't know. Like look at that. It's off. The second we got here I felt a weird presence. And that doesn't this, make sense. And then this happened to the camera. We're filming this on the iPhone right now. Yeah. What the f is going on? 
Still nothing. I'm gonna try to take the battery out. Put it back in. Hopefully it works. Working. That is so. I've never had that happen before. Just when we came here in front of this building that says close, we went bankrupt. So that was the weirdest. That was the weirdest experience ever. I've never had that happen to my equipment before. Usually batteries get drained whenever there's something like paranormal in the area. But the second I got to this door over here. My camera just started to malfunction. Very strange. All these carriages over here left behind from back in those days when they actually used them before even cars existed. So cool. Yeah. There's like a door in the middle of the house. Yeah, so cool. Guys, look at this. This is random little grave over here. I don't think it's a real grave, but it's weird. Harley, here lies Harry Drinkwater. He never did. <laughs> I wonder if that's actually like real. Even have old like posters from back in the day whenever like people were wanted five thousand dollars that's a lot of money back yeah, in those days in the day. damn they really wanted that guy Deborah badly I feel like I'm in an old town right now. well it is an old town no, like, this is a legit ghost town yeah. um, like, I feel like I'm in back in the days when I came here I was expecting it to be like an abandoned ghost town yeah. but it didn't turn out to be that but I'm still posting this video because I know you guys would still love and appreciate this oh what? my god that's a noose what? <laughs> I was like is that a noose it's a noose. It's a mini noose. So apparently there's a mine that we can go into here. It's called Maggie Mine. Maggie's Mine. I wonder if it's like Maggie's Bridge, the haunted Maggie's Bridge. Look at that, dude. Yo, there's houses in the mountain. That's not even funny. Like, I want a house in the mountain. Why do they get houses in the mountain? The entire building is made from bottles and some type of, like, cement compound. That's so funny. You can just literally break through the walls if you want to. You just grab a baseball bat and start ha hacking away. Making our way down to a place called Maggie's Mine on this really shady bridge. Oh my god, it feels like it's gonna break any, oh any second now. So I feel like, I feel like there is, there could be some type of paranormal. Well, there definitely is cause so, this town was full of like old miners that passed away here, right? Yeah. Doing work. Obviously, there was a lot of death. There is a haunted cemetery here, actually. Mm -hmm. It's down the mountain. I'm gonna, I might actually do a separate video in that cemetery. So you guys are gonna have to look forward to that. So apparently, there's a, a tunnel that we can go into here. This is so cool. We can go into the tunnel here. It's three dollars each. Yeah, no problem. So they apparently found dinosaur poop in here. It's 140 million years old. And then you have all these other stones that they found in this mine. Apparently, $83 million of silver and ore was mined out of this place. All right, guys, moving into the mine. We're actually walking through the mine right now. I didn't know we were able to do this. So they used to mine things out of here. What? What am I looking at? It's cage rock. This is like where they used to climb an out of, exit. I guess. Yeah, that's so cool. It's like an emergency thing. I wish I had my flashlight with me. I didn't expect I'd be going underground. Oh my God, there's two ways. Which way do we go? There are two different tunnels in here. I don't know where each one goes. Where the heck do we go? I don't know. I feel like we should go to the one that's lit up, right? That lit up? I feel like we should go that one. That one yeah. looks scarier. Lit up, that's what I mean. Okay, that one looks darker to me. I don't know about you. Really? Yeah, that one looks darker to me. That should... one looks darker. That one looks lit, that lit one... up more. I don't know, you guys can let us know in the comments below. Is it number one, is that one more lit up or number two more lit up? But apparently that one is supposed to be super haunted in there. Apparently there's a cavern in there, so let's go. Moving deeper and deeper into the mine. This is so cool. If you guys are watching this right now, man, you guys are in for a treat because Shadi and I have so many cool haunted adventures coming your way. As we are traveling throughout the USA, we're doing a road trip all the way back to Canada. You guys have to remember to stay on my Instagram, on my stories, on my Twitter. Make sure you're liking and retweeting because we're going to be telling you guys what location and we might do fan meetups as well. So what the heck is this supposed to be? Look at this. We're still deep in the mines right now. I think it goes in like 2,000 feet from what I heard. Whoa. Oh, this is the Dead Man's Rift. That's what it's called. Really? Yeah, a lot of people have died in here apparently. Oh my gosh. Jesus, guys, this is the Dead Man's Rift, and people have actually died. All right, Shadi, so we've explored the first cavern over there. That was the Dead Man's Rift. I wonder what's through this one now. This is the other side. This is the left side. The one that I think. Just, just admire all of this. Like, look at this. <laughs> it's cool. Like, it looks like mini tunnels that you can escape out of. A lot of times when I go filming, I don't get a chance to just literally admire it and look at it because I'm so busy trying to film something and get you guys content. Mm -hmm. Shadia does have a point. It looks really cool here. Do you think you can climb up this? I don't want to climb up that. <laughs> we don't have free healthcare here. We're not in Canada. Well, what is that noise? I thought that was a real guy. What? Scary. 
it. Whoa. This is cool. Wait, what's that noise? What the hell is that bang? There's something banging up there. Is somebody trapped up there? So not only did the miners spend their entire lives working in these mines, but they actually slept in them. I don't know. There's a weird loud noise out here. <laughs> it's like some guy trapped. Yo, this reminds me of like some scary ass movie. It, remind, it reminds Why me of- Why is there a random be a bird? <laughs> so back in the day, whenever they would go into mines, mm -hmm. they would bring birds with them. Because if the bird died, that means there's no oxygen and they have to get the hell out of there. Or there's some sort of chemical. Mm -hmm. So the bird goes in first and it makes sure that it's safe. But the bird risks his life. Exactly. Noise. We're trying to get to this strange noise at the end of the mine. It's a fan. That's scary, yo. What the hell? That's so scary. So that other creepy tunnel that we went through, it leads up these massive stairs, and then we get to leave. Shadow, you gotta go the other way. Really? Yeah, baby. Yeah, that way. Yeah, there you go. That's scary. <laughs> it's like prison. Oh my god. This thing sounds deadly. As you guys can see, we've made it back outside somewhere. No clue where we are. But I think if we go up these stairs. Yo, I'm hoping we get to see like a rattlesnake or something. You guys know, I always say this. I'm trying to find a damn snake. Mom, what is this door? <laughs> That's like another exit from the mine shaft. Like a really old one. We're making our way up to this really crazy rock. Super high and it's almost like off the edge of the mountain here. Whoa. Now this is a view. Whoa! This is so cool. Come on up here, little pinky. I'm kind of scared. Yo, look at this. I feel so tiny over here. Unbelievable. Now this is a gorgeous view. Look at that. This is. Uh, I mean, it's not that high. It's pretty high. It's not that bad. But this is so cool. This is what it means to live a little. We weren't even planning on coming here. I didn't know this place even existed <laughs> until we just like found a sign that said ghost town. I was like, yo, ghost town? What? All right, let's go to the ghost town. We just took some really cool Instagram pictures on the edge of a cliff. But now we're going to the highest point that we're allowed to climb up over here. If it was up to me, I would literally hike up the mountain. Look at the difference the Yeah, the mountain here is like red. It's weird. Oh. My God. Cool. Now this is epic. We get to see the sunset from here too. Pretty cool. Wow. Oh my God. I feel like I'm on planet Mars right now. With all this red rock. You can see the Calico sign from here now. We seen that thing from like 30 miles away. Yeah. Shadi and I are finding all these like little, tiny little holes here. Like start pounding on that wall, we can find some silver. <laughs> pounding with what? <laughs> what am I gonna pound on the wall with? Check it out, you guys. This used to be a miner's home at one point in time. They have it locked off. I really wish I can get in here, but this is how it's still standing after all these years. Probably hundreds of years. I don't know how many years, but we're walking across this really. I don't think. I don't think this bridge is safe, babe. It does not feel good. There's a school that we're trying to get to. So this is the old school that used to be here in the mining town way back in the day. I guess the miners that had children would just leave their kids here in school in the mornings while they were all working and grinding hard in that mine. I don't think I can get inside. The doors are locked. Keep in mind, all this is original. Damn. Whoa, look at that. Holy crap, that is so cool. All the kids... Not all, check it out. I'm guessing all these names carved into the original paint belong to the kids that used to go to this place. Never know, maybe a child died in there. I mean, it's possible. A lot of people back then, you know, they weren't healthy. They didn't have doctors like we did now. Feel closer. Looks like when it was like fresh painted or something, it was engraved. See, there's a name called Paul. Yeah. There's I think Andy. Do you see Tom in there? Yo, Tom, my boy, you piece of shit. I think I owe this to you guys. 
to say it because it's been a long time since I said it. Yo, Tom, my boy, you piece of shit. <laughs> what was that? Tom just arrives up in the mountains. Come I bet there. this place is so haunted at nighttime. Wait, what? Especially this over here. What is that? Is that a hole? Oh, there's a hole in there. Damn. It'd be cool if there's something inside of that. Yep. This, you know what that is? Guess what that is. Is that like a potty for the kids? Yeah, that's, that's the outhouse. They have to go outside? Yeah, back then there was no plumbing or nothing. Poor kids. What do you mean? Imagine taking a poop between these mountains. I'm down for that. Yeah, but that looks haunted. <laughs> Making our way out of this ghost town. There is a creepy cemetery down below. Apparently it's haunted. I want to check it out. I want to see what's inside of it. Maybe we can come back here tonight and do some type of spirit box video Ooh. in the actual cemetery. I'm loving this view though. This is this is what this means guys. Be you, do you, and live a little. I'm being myself, I'm doing what I do, and I'm living a little with my beautiful wife over here. It's very easy just to get out, get in the car, drive until you find something random. This wasn't planned, this was completely random. I love the spontaneous like adventures that you have with me. Yeah, I know. We always like somehow stumble upon like the awesomest stuff and not even planning it. Like when we plan things, it literally never works out for us. Yeah. There is no way. No way in hell that there is a Starbucks coffee in this town. So if you ever died here in this town and put into the cemetery, this is literally the coffin that you're put in. God, I did not so want you to go in there. <laughs> this is so creepy. Oh my god, it's tiny though. So these are some of the miners that lived here in the town. Actual pictures. Whoa. If you notice, people back in the day never smiled for photos. Because if you did, you would call, get called crazy. Are you serious? Yeah, nobody spawned for photos back then. Whoa. Oh, that's a silver. I don't know. Kernite. Silver ore, colmanite. Num number one is silver ore. So that, wait, no, that's silver ore. Yeah. You'd think silver would be silver color, but it's yeah. not. I don't know, maybe it's wrong. I don't know, this is weird. But whatever the heck that thing is, it's cool. Making our way out of the ghost town right now, coming back down the mountain. So we realized something. We realized... We sort of snuck into this place. We, we didn't know. We just came to the back parking lot. We parked here and we walked up these stairs. We didn't pay. There was, yeah, we didn't pay. Like, I would have paid. Yeah. I guess they don't want money. I don't know. There was nobody at the gates. I was, feel like maybe they didn't care anymore. Because maybe because like we came like an hour before closing. Yeah. So there is the cemetery. It's called the Calico Cemetery. I asked the lady in the mine shaft. She said it's super haunted. Um, so we're going to go take a look at that and maybe spend some time throughout the night tonight stay here all night and do a paranormal investigation at the cemetery. That's where the cemetery is. That's where we're trying to get to. But the security guard over here literally just told us to leave. They're closing, which is weird. Like, it's a cemetery. What if my great, 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 great grandpappy worked here? Yeah, he's literally driving right behind us. <laughs> I'm just going to keep the camera aimed behind us because there's a guy with a gun following us in a truck. I don't really feel safe with this person who's blasting his lights behind us either. I mean, it's a security guard. So we tried to get into the cemetery and unfortunately, that security guard um, closed the gates. Apparently at five o'clock they closed. And it sucks that it's getting really dark at five o'clock, but we are gonna continue the adventure to Las Vegas. Are you ready for this? Aren't we like two hours away? Guys, one of the main reasons why we're not flying back to Canada is because we have so much luggage. Literally, guys. We did a big shopping spree in Los Angeles, and we're like, shit, man. We want so much stuff in LA that we can't even fly back to Canada. No, I'm just joking. We just wanted to road trip through all of the USA. So if you do have locations, so we're going to be in Vegas for three days, and then we're going to be in... Colorado. I think we're gonna go to Iowa. We're gonna be in Chicago. We're gonna be in Nebraska. We're gonna be in Kansas We're gonna stop off at every major city and major state on our way back to Canada from Vegas uh, We're gonna be in Utah. So if you guys want to host us too um, Feel free as well. That'd be really cool. We'll give you guys a shout out if you guys want or pay you if you want I don't care. Anyways, <laughs> let's go to Vegas and see what that's all about I've only been to Vegas once for a few hours to catch My a first flight time. her first time, but I never really got to enjoy Vegas. So 
We're gonna get, enjoy it together. What happens in Vegas stays in Vegas, motherfucker. Decided to continue this video vlog style. We are currently in Vegas, our first time going to a Vegas hotel. So pretty um, excited about that. We're staying at this hotel called the Sahara or Sahara. I don't know how to say it. But if you guys from around here, you probably know what it, what it is. We're trying to find a room right now. By the way, if you guys want to watch more vlogs of me and Shadia, we post almost daily on the second vlog channel, the Sarji Family Vlog Channel. All right, let's first impression. First impression. Oh my God. What? Yo, this is boss. Ooh. This is cool. Is it haunted? Is it haunted? <laughs> this is nice. It is nice. Wait, what's going on? This is literally what sold me for this room. This is why you want me to get this room? I it was actually really cheap too. Listen, I literally want this in my house. Whoa, what the hell? Yep. Oh my god. Got another one here. Dude, this is so cool. This okay, I don't know about that painting behind me while I'm sleeping. It's weird. Yeah, that is weird. <laughs> but wait, that's just a... Oh, that's a blind. Yeah. Look at that. There's double mirrors here. Whoa! So All right, cool. we're definitely playing Bloody Bloody Mary on the mirrors here at nighttime, Shadia. Yeah, this is so nice. Who, do you guys want us to do a mirror ritual in this hotel room? I think it'd be a really good idea. So this is the bathroom over here in our little hotel room in Vegas. I think it's pretty cool, it's pretty clean, modern. Believe it or not, we got this room for like $40. I kid you not, I think it's because Sunday. it's a Sunday night. $40 a night, but that's like pocket change, it's nothing. So yeah, there you have it, this is our home for the next two to three days here in Vegas. The grind starts tomorrow. Today we're just gonna kick back and chill in Vegas. And then tomorrow I'm gonna be filming some haunted locations. You guys have that to look forward to. But guys, once again, go subscribe to my daily vlog channel, the Sarji Family Vlog Channel. I'm posting a lot of cool content that I don't post onto this video. Yes, that's a toilet flushing. Shadia's using the bathroom. But anyways, don't tell Shadia. I think I should sneak myself one of these drinks here. Oh, hi. I know I see you right Oh, hi. Oh, what a cute fridge. Yeah, I, I'm just trying to have a water here. Oh, okay. Just, just the so water. So they're going to charge you like 20 bucks for that, but okay. Probably $100 yeah. for a of water. But you know what? The valet parking was actually free here. So I don't know, the water would be free too. Guys, I don't drink alcohol. Me I do either. not drink alcohol. She doesn't drink alcohol. We don't do drugs. We don't do any of that stuff. I don't need it. I'm high on life. I'm high off my sergeants. I'm high off living a little. Get yourself to live a little merch. Anyways, thank you guys so much for accompanying us to Vegas. Oh yeah, if you guys have locations that you guys want us to film, make sure to comment them down below. We need locations to film, okay? Don't forget to be you, do you, stay positive, and just live a little. Love you guys from the bottom of my heart. Peace.